What's happening guys? Mike here from Hammer Fitness. Today we are going skydiving. So, this is uh, based on a topic that I want to cover with you guys and actually facing fears uh, and just setting yourself uh, fear-like tasks to actually get done. It can be fun, like I reckon skydiving is going to be fun, but obviously you're kind of scared of dying. So, Let's face that fear, let's knock it on the head. Uh, and what we're doing here is pretty much building your threshold for stress. If you can pretty much face fears uh, head on and just get them done, in a way you're building your threshold uh, or your capacity to handle different kinds of stress in life. All right, so just like training a muscle in the gym, if you can train your willpower, you can also train your stress, um, and I guess you can train your threshold for fear as well. All right, so I'm out today to actually go test those limits. Uh, I thought I'd quickly log now, I'm on the way over now. I booked it in about a week ago and I wasn't too, too scared then. Obviously I was uh, thinking about it at an intellectual level, not an emotional level, that's why it doesn't really affect you. Just like, you know, when you're going away, uh, you might get excited, but you actually really get excited when you're actually at the airport or when you're actually on the road trip when you're going there. So, thought I'd quickly log now, see how I'm feeling. Kind of butterflies in my stomach now, so I'll uh, quickly log again just before we're about to get there, see how we're traveling. Okay, so we're here at the lovely St Kilda Beach. Uh, just signed up paid for all the extra photos videos and stuff we're about to uh, jump in the I think the shuttle bus it's gonna take us to one of the airports in the nearby location so we can get on a plane and go up there all right we'll see how we go um, I think uh, no nerves have started picking up yet we haven't gone through the rundown on how to actually get in our gear so I think maybe once we're on the shuttle bus and we see a plane maybe that's when the nerves will kick up a bit Done and done. That was uh, up and over pretty quick. Literally up and over. Um, wow. You can definitely see how uh, those skydivers get addicted. It was uh, funny. Even until I was just about leaning my legs over the door, adrenaline was starting to kick up heaps, and uh, yeah, I was just embracing it. Was the best part. Just letting it happen. Um, yeah, the best feeling ever, so Everyone uh, keeps telling me that have skydived. It's just such a quick fall. Yeah, you get to embrace that but even when you're just floating down just really embrace the uh, serenity and You get to look out over the water and just everything else. I would definitely do it again so like I mentioned pretty much Facing fears or just uh, things that could just terrify the crap out of you. I could definitely see how Doing something like that elevates uh, your threshold to even stress or fear of anything. I mean, like, once you do that, then, I mean, what's scarier than that? And you just keep pushing your boundaries. And the same goes for life or lifting or anything. You just keep pushing yourself uh, to the limits. Now what I'd actually like to do is, uh, after doing that, go and get my certificate to maybe just do it myself. Maybe that's the next step to stepping it up again. But, that moving on to the next fear so my challenge to you is to face one fear in the next month please hit me up if you do let me know what you did I'd love to see uh, how you felt about it and how you felt after it as well all right have fun enjoy and I'll see you in the next video